Good man. Calling the election to show up, Peter said. <clears throat> the, I always bring this out once in bring us out once in a while here and there. Give diligence to make that call in the election. Sure, Peter said that. Uh, one of the apostles, the head apostle, uh, the Rock, as uh, Yahweh Shai referred to him as, made him the head man. The apostle Paul said that you all show the same diligence. So if I'm doing a video every day, you should be doing a video every day, and not a ten, not a five minute video. Not a 10 minute video, but sometimes I'll do little short videos, but I'll do long videos too. Sometimes I go real long, hour, two hours. That's, you know, I believe that's the spirit hitting me. Spirit might hit me right now, but I'm going to try to make this short and go to the point. You got, let me open up the calculator. Calculator. Okay, let me go 24, 24 times 7, so which is 7 days a week, equals 168 hours, almost a hun 2 hours shy of 170 hours. Inside of 168 170 almost hours in a week you only do what amounts to an hour video maybe an hour and a half video and when I say that I mean you do a little five minute video here a little ten minute video there you might take two three days off it might do a 15 minute video there that's unaccept that's that's unacceptable you're not diligent you're living life you're going through the motions it's not coming from the heart you know it's like in school when i was in school elementary school you they would have tests so i said what's passing they would say 65 i said okay i'm gonna get a 65 or a 70. i just did enough i didn't i didn't give a fuck about no fucking school you know, I ain't trying to achieve nothing in the school system. I knew the school system was bullshit. I told the principal, I said, "This guy, what do, what, what's your problem? Why? I said, this is bullshit. This is fucking bullshit. That there's a uh, term, I believe I heard this, uh, the, the school to prison pipeline, which, uh, means the school system is set up like the prison system. When you go eat, it's just, the tables are set up, you get those trays. You go to any school. You Look, you can go to any public school. That's, I'm saying in New York. Let's say the Bronx, Staten Island, whatever. Go to any any school, and you can make a prison movie using the, using the school because it's set up the same way as a prison system. Look, just like a, a public school. And a lot of people that attend public school wind up in the prison system. They get them goddamn trays. They get that terrible, terrible food. You know? Then they sit down at the same, it's, it's, it's the same setup, man. So they getting ready, they getting you ready for the prison system. Anyway, let me get back into this. If you're doing what amounts to an hour, hour and a half, maybe even two hours of videos, 10 minutes here, 15 minutes there, five minutes here, 22 minutes there. You're not diligent. You're not diligent at all. You're not diligent at all. Anyway, so the ones of you that are not diligent, either you're cold or you're lukewarm, guess what? Yahweh Ba'ashem Yahweh Shah spew you out of his mouth. And I used to bring that up every Saturday when we had the camp. And them, them brothers, a lot of them came against me 
it would bring me to council saying, um, anytime I come through the door into Hawes there, it felt like swords were flying at me. And I, and my response was, well, if that's the case, you ain't doing the right thing. You know, maybe you deserve to get them swords flying at you. And needless to say, every last one of them in that camp, they all went back into the world and they're all going to get chipped and they're all going to die. The only ones that are left was uh, is uh, Bishop Nathaniel, the bishop, and Apostle Gabar. The rest of them are that 50, 51, 52. They're all back in the world. Some of them are dead. Some of them are, went back to being Baptist. Some of them are Muslim. Some of them black conscious. Hey, Ariar's uh, nephew, I forget his name. He had died a couple of years back, three, four, five years years back. Now, because he came out, he said, yeah, I'm Ariar's nephew. He he died because uh, he, he, he was raised up in the truth, and he abandoned the truth to follow the new opinions. And what did Mosai do? The Mosai took him out. Mosai takes people out. If you ain't if you ain't diligent, and a lot of you ain't a lot of you are not diligent. Now, now challenge me. Are you talking about me, Tar? Well, if you come up, I'm gonna click on your page. I'm gonna see how many videos and the power of the videos. The, the Apostle Paul spoke spoke about the power. Is there power in your, uh, let me go see where I can find that. If I can get the whole phrase in my head. Anyway, you know what I'm going to do? Where the hell did I just go? Okay, let's get back into this. So, bricks and uh, MOTB one the same. This new bricks, like it's a new brick, a new system of the BRICS nations. They got their own money system. They're no longer dealing with the do dollar, the U.S. dollar, the Federal Reserve note. Eventually, everything's going to become one do a digital dollar. So let me read. This is from a video put up by. Uh, uh, Taza, which is spelled wrong. It should be ta za doc But let maybe he spelled it wrong for a reason. I don't know. 144. And Taza means uh, righteous. You guys got to get your Hebrew up. Unless you deliberately put it in there like that. It was supposed to be ta za doc uh bricks bricks pay and the uh, MOTB yeah bricks pay is another name for the MOTB so let me just read this so you can watch the rest of this video I just watched up to this point I said let me make a video on it moreover the exchange method mainly related relied on I'm sorry QR codes <clears throat> a QR code is if you don't know what that is I'll bring it up for you let me do this and show you what a QR code is which is part of the uh, one step closer to the MOD MOTB system or bricks pay whatever you want to call it okay Q R code. Let 
Let me put in meaning. Meaning. <laughs> That's a QR code. Now, I thought these represented six. Maybe they do, but I looked it up and they say no, they don't represent sixes. This, however, right here, which is a UPC Universal Product Code, that represents a six, that represents a six, that represents a six. So that's your, your QR code right there which means QR, quick response. QR code, definition, and meaning. QR stands for quick response while, while they, and you can get the app for that, you know, get all the info, you go to the QR code, you know, what is it, take a picture or whatever. While they may look simple, QR codes are cap uh, capable of storing lots of data but no matter how much they contain when scanned the QR code should allow the user to access information instantly instantaneously hence why it's called a quick response uh, code And come back over here. Moreover, the exchange method uh, mainly relied on QR codes. These codes connect national subscription platforms with commercial methods across BRICS plus countries, because there's more than the, uh, which is Brazil, Russia, India, China and South Africa. They're getting ready to have a, uh, su if they didn't have the summit already. This means BRICS pay enables transactions in digital or in digital forms. Which all the BRICS, all this is going to lead to the uh, um, unlocking the door and it's slowly opening the door or quickly opening the door. And you got these major camps that not, that's not teaching you. They're not warning you. They're not getting ready. The number one camp out there is GMS. Point blank period. And these top major camps that teach otherwise, I, be, I believe that they know what they're doing. I believe, in other words, I'm, what I mean, let me rephrase that. They took a bag or a truck truckload of bags. You're gonna find out that these guys sold out and you're gonna get shocked when you find out my teacher, my master teacher sold out. He went to the Diddy parties too. So um, where am I gonna go from here? And Diddy, the, the whole Diddy thing is a distraction any goddamn way. It's entertainment. Entertainment, when you look up the word entertainment, one of the definitions is this a distraction.